and welcome to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to win a virtual million pounds by simply answering 15 questions in a row correctly. So if you're ready, let's play. Hello and welcome back. That's great. I Is still it just me, Chris. So it's just you, me and the computer. OK, if you would, enter your name. Ah, that'll do. <laughs> OK. Would and you like me no. to... If you don't need instructions, let's play. No, I think I know what I'm doing by now. Well, I know how to play it. <laughs> Good luck. Now, I hope you're ready for this. Here comes your first question. It's worth £100. Which of the following are banned from motorways? Learner drivers. Of course it is. You've got 100 quid. Here's question two. It's worth 200 pounds. What name is given to a person who intimidates another? Copycat. It's correct. You've got 200 quid. Intimidates? That's a word, isn't it? Uh, mimics. That's a word. You're doing I well. You're just 13 questions away from a million. Look at this for three hundred pounds. What sort of animal do you talk the hind legs off when you talk endlessly? That would be a donkey. So you think it's a? You've got three hundred pounds. Right, you're twelve questions away from a million. Now this one is worth five hundred pounds. Take your time. Have a look at it. Well, uh, let me try again. What did the ancient Egyptians make from the papyrus plants? That would right. be writing material. So you're saying it's A. Are you confident? That's the right answer for £500. <laughs> Don't forget, you've still got all three lifelines. Use them if you need to. That's what they're there for. OK, have a look. Uh, you're just one question away from your first milestone. It's for a guaranteed £1,000. Here it comes. Which of these refers to a small brown spot on the skin? That's a liver spot. So you're saying it's A. Are you confident? If this answer is correct, you're guaranteed to leave here with at least £1,000. Well done. It is the right answer. Creaked so much. Don't know why. Problem is, though, my chair creaks and I move too much, so. <laughs> That's a thousand pounds of a bad guarantee. Well. <laughs> but let's try and double that with the next question. You might as well play this. You've got nothing to lose. You're guaranteed one thousand. This one is for two thousand pounds. Who wrote the novel Hollywood Wives? So, the Jackie so you think it's else A. Still. You've just won two thousand pounds. Oh, yeah. I said Danny Elstow to start with, and then they told me it was Jackie Collins. So. You're doing brilliantly. You've got two thousand pounds. But take a look at this next question for 4,000. Which novel is based on the adventures of Alexander Selkirk shipwrecked in 704? It's either going to be Treasure Island or Robinson Crusoe. All right, take your time. You've still got all three... I'm going to go Robinson Crusoe. You're saying D. Mm. OK. You happy to go orange? It's the right answer. Hey. You've got £4,000. Well done. <laughs> the next question takes you past the halfway mark for the 15 correct answers you need for £1 million. Good luck. Here it comes for £8,000. <laughs> Which
Each vegetable is used to make sauerkraut, and that's cabbage. You're going for D. Anything about food now? You had four thousand pounds. <laughs> you could have walked away. You didn't. I love You've now got eight thousand pounds. <laughs> Eat pumpkin. I do love pumpkin. I also make far too many cakes. But since making all the cakes, um, I can't eat cake now. <laughs> I've had too much. You'll win sixteen thousand pounds if you give me the correct answer to the next question. It's number nine of fifteen. Take a look at it. Here it comes. Kiev is the capital of which country? Um, I want to say Ukraine. I'm going to go Ukraine. You're going for D. You had £8,000. You didn't have to play. You did. I'm pretty sure it's Ukraine. It was the right it answer. Is, yeah. You just won £16,000. Do you know why? It was only last night I was talking to someone about the Eurovision Song Contest this year. <laughs> I was like, where's it being held? They're like, Kiev. Capital of Ukraine. I'm like, ah. Oh. So, thank you, by the way. You've still got all three lifelines left. <laughs> For that, city, that, phone that, a friend, and that helps. the audience. <laughs> so, you've now got £16,000. Now, this next question is worth £32,000. If you get it right, you're guaranteed to leave with at least that amount of money. But if you get it wrong, you drop 15 of the £16,000 you've got at this moment. You don't have to play this question, but it's worth £32,000 guaranteed. Take your time. Here it comes. Which of these countries does not border the Baltic Sea? I don't know. I'm gonna use my first lifeline. Oh, okay, actually. right, using up your lifeline. Ask the audience, all votes now. Line. Well, they seem pretty confident it's A. So it's up to you entirely. What do you think? I'm gonna go with them. Again, not the greatest at geography, so. I'm gonna go you don't have hungry. Are you happy with that? You've just guaranteed hey. yourself thirty-two thousand pounds. Now, whatever happens, I'll be writing you out a check for at least £32,000. But we don't want to give you that. I don't want to take want it. We'll write you out a check for much, much more. I'm after that million, The next question Chris. is worth £64,000. It's a chance to double your okay. money. You're guaranteed £32,000. Okay. And you might as well play. Here it comes. Give me a good one. Which Formula One Grand Prix takes place at the Interlagos Circuit? <sighs> Do I 50 50? No, I'm just, you know, I'm Okay, just you want to phone a friend. Now let's call them, but remember, you don't have to go along with one. what they say. And I'm hoping you give me someone who knows racing. Hello? Hi, Rob, this is Chris Hi, Tarrant Bob. from Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Hi, Chris. Right, you know we're into some really serious money now. Your friend is completely stuck. Hopefully you can get them through it. It's worth, no pressure, £64,000. Not a problem, Chris. Are we going to play anyway? Okay, Rob, here we go with the question. Now, remember, three of these answers are wrong. For £64,000, I can definitely tell you that the Interlagos circuit is the Brazilian Grand Prix. Hey! Right, go for it. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Okay, Rob, that's great. I Thanks had for your faith help, and you've pulled well, through. Well, he's saying... Let's go Brazilian. Are you absolutely sure? No, but he is. <laughs> you had nothing to lose by playing this question. And you haven't. Hey. You just won £64,000. Come on. <laughs> it's got to happen at some point. <laughs> 
Other than that, or in ten years' time, now I'm just you're going to play this really game. Now you're getting money territory. The God next sake, question Kelly, is worth <laughs> one hundred and twenty-five thousand pounds, and you are just four away from a million. Take your time. You don't have to play it, but here it comes. Yeah, but I'm going to play it, Chris. Have you not learned this yet? Which animal has a breed called a Brittany? I want to say horse. But why do I want to say horse? I don't know. Um, or do I use my lifeline? I take your time on this one. It's for a big, big one hundred and twenty-five thousand pound check. Serious money. No, it's. Too... I'm gonna fifty. Okay, 50 time it. to go fifty-fifty. Computer, take away two wrong answers, please, leaving the right answer and the one remaining wrong answer. So, is it A or C? Uh, well, it's left horse. I'm gonna go horse. Are you happy with that? Yeah, go for it. Well, you had a cheque for £64,000. You didn't have to play this question. You did. You've just lost ah. £32,000. I'm so sorry. That's the wrong answer. Really? A dog? C is the right answer. Ah. Well, I've learned something. <laughs> oh, well. Well... I got fairly far on that one. I think I'm going to leave it there for today. So I'm going to say thank you very much for watching, guys. And I'll see you in the next episode.